So you see how her eyes, her slow that way and fast that way? Yeah. So the lesion is usually towards the slow side. She's circling this way? Not really circling, no, just mostly just falling leaning. and leaning. Okay. So what's that doing? Has it caused a reaction to her? Yeah, it's a rib. Oh. Drinking okay? Decently, yeah. She got a pack though yesterday, uh, sub Q. Uh, okay. One side of the cerebellum may not be firing enough, and the other mm -hmm. side might be firing too much. So that's exactly what she had going on. Really? So it didn't take much of my therapy to negate that, meaning where I couldn't find it anymore. So that's good. That's really okay. good. So it, it, I guess, in a sense, think of it as pathology or no pathology. I call this a no pathology. Oh, like just, no brain tumor now, I mean, right? Yeah, I mean, who knows what it is. If it's right. a little um, vascular accident okay. or something like that. I mean, that's kind of what we end up assuming is that there's a little vascular accident, but nobody's been able to actually prove right. it for sure, at least in every single case. Um, so that, and then that, uh, the vestibular system in connection with the cerebellum sends information through the spinal cord which allows us to have balance so if I pushed you you would go like this to catch your balance right so that's part of the spinal cords pathway is to allow us to catch our balance so it was definitely affecting her right side and that's why you were seeing the leaning um, again it didn't take much to clear that up <clears throat> lastly she did have a hiatal hernia which I don't know if she's had before but it's basically heartburn and that's why she's not eating very good. Which is strange because for the past couple of weeks, so you know with all the diet, she's been burping and we find her like in the morning, so she's like Yeah. So she's probably getting like yeah. maybe some acid yeah. indigestion. And that's very much a chiropractic issue. So work that through. Um, her pelvis needed to be adjusted. So you were asking what does this have to do yeah. with this? Yeah. Well, two two answers to that. One okay. If they're having a problem with their right front leg, I don't just look at the right front leg, I look at the entire body. So I never just focus on the problem. Okay. Two is that they're very interconnected because of a membrane that surrounds our central nervous system that's called the dura mater. Yeah. So we have a very intimate layer that lays on our brain and our spinal cord. And then there's another layer of membrane that connects that to the bony structure uh, and the dura mater. So there's three layers of these meninges, they call them, in our central nervous system. Well, the dura mater 
literally translates to tough, tough mother in oh. German. And so they've actually found that if you take the Dura Mater out of the cow, I think they did, you can actually suspend a semi truck because it's that <gasps> Really? Holy crap. 2,000 pounds or something like that. So the Dura Mater connects um, very intimately with the sacrum and the cranium and upper cervical spine, and then it's loosely attached to the rest of the vertebra. So if you have a problem down here, yeah. it's going to cause a problem up here because that's how it's all connected. And then the dura mater actually covers our spinal nerves and our peripheral nerves. So it's very much a um, big organ, if you will, that people just don't even think about. Uh, no, she's she's walking straighter already. Yeah, Thank you, Dr. So this is day six of Moreau. As you can see, she's walking much better. Come on. Although she doesn't want to seem to go. So come on. She can hold herself up a lot better. Come on. Let's go. Still very unstable going up and down stairs. She fell twice this morning. And she can mostly jump up on the couches. We do try to avoid that. Um, and I don't like her getting down either. But we're working on this. Come on. Let's go. Maru. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. Okay, there you go. She's trying, guys. Her backpack might be a little lopsided. Uh-oh. But she's doing really well. For the most part. She's really tired and we only went one and a half blocks. But it's okay.